Und hier melde ich mich mal wieder zurück, kurz mal mit einer ja, Nebeninformation so mal wieder mischen. Wir sind jetzt hier in Gecko, der übelst verstrahlten Metropole der Gule. Und wir treffen hier auf einen Altbekannten, äh, auf Harold, wie ihr im Titel ja sicherlich schon gesehen habt. Äh, haben wir schon im ersten Teil getroffen. Besonderheit hier ist, dass er hier schon den Baumfortsatz hat. 
der ja im dritten Teil ihn zu behängen ist. Warte, jetzt schaut mal hin, ich bin mal kurz ruhig jetzt für das Gespräch. Mein Name ist Harold. Ich helfe, diese Stadt zu halten. Du hast mit dem dullen Ende der Knife gekauft, oder? Du siehst nicht wie ein orange Peel, der in der Sonne gelassen hat, alle Tage. Deine Haut ist noch schön und schön. Was brauchst du, Jungster? Whatever it takes to keep this place together. Better job on it than me. <laughs> yep, but I'm doing great for being dead. <laughs> I never get tired of the looks when I tell that one. <laughs> well, sort of. Our atomic reactors are mind sensitive. The people I got running it mean well, but... Oh, <laughs> well, they are not the sharpest tools in the shed, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Need a little time on the whetstone yourself, huh? I mean, they are not too bright. Here's an example. The other day, I get a report. On it, it says the main coolant valve should be shut down. That would have caused a meltdown. That would make the Grand Canyon look like a pig walla. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that would be bad. <coughs> Now, I got things fixed up in time, but <coughs> we came close to the end there. Whew. They need someone to watch out for them. <coughs> Who'd have thought I'd be making things right? Although, if we don't get a hydroelectric magnetosphere regulator pretty damn quick, there is gonna be trouble. <laughs> well, technically, it's a thingy. Without a functional hydroelectric magnetosphere regulator, we are leaking radioactive coolant into the groundwater. Now, that means anyone using that water is not going to need a nightlight to take a midnight piss. Also, we need more fuel because our power plant is not burning it very efficiently. <laughs> Well, I'm certain those ornery bastards in Vault City have one. Not that they'd share them. Hell, even if we had one of those thingies, I'm not so certain Festus could install the dang thing. <laughs> well, they'd only help us if they thought it was in their own best interest to do so. <laughs> not much chance of that happening. <laughs> They shoot ghouls on sight. Makes conversation a bit tricky. We need a hydroelectric magnetosphere regulator, and it needs to be installed soon, or we have got some real problems. <laughs> If we don't get it, you can bet those boneheads from Vault City will shut down our power plant permanently. Take dirt naps. Vault City doesn't play nice. They'll just come up here and kill all of us if we don't get that part. Well, <laughs> at least I'll have a tree for a monument. We need a hydroelectric magnetosphere regulator, and it needs to be installed soon, or we have got some real problems. We get our fuel from the Broken Hills. That's a mining community some way south. Well, well, they'd only help. They shoot ghouls on sight. We need a hydroelectric magnetosphere regulator, and it needs to be installed soon. What you need, youngster? Jealous? His name's Herbert. I talk to him when I get lonely. <laughs> Just kidding. His name's Bob. What you need, youngster? A Garden of Eden creation kit? A gick, right? Well, I seem to remember vaults had those. Don't know where you'd find one today.
Ja. Harold und Lenny, Lenny und Harold. Ja, ihr habt ihn kurz gesehen, den Baum. Für alle, die Fallout 3 gespielt haben. Ja, wir wissen, was mit Harold irgendwann mal passieren wird. Man trifft ihn auch noch später äh, mal in einem anderen Fallout-Teil, und zwar äh, Fallout Brotherhood of Steel. Ein bisschen, ja, ich würde fast sagen, ein unbeliebteres Spiel davon. Ich weiß nicht, ob ich das auch mal Vox ruhen bzw. Let's Play werde. Mal schauen. So, jetzt weiter im Text zum Survival Guest Locker. Um Woody zu finden. Wir hören uns bald wieder. Bis dann.